Naga Munchetti found herself in hot water during a chat with a NASA space expert on the BBC breakfast. The TV star, 49 was joined by her co-star Charlie State as they interviewed no-nonsense scientist Dr. Ken Creamer. He appeared on the program via video link in the studio damning reports that two astronauts were stranded in space. It was believed that NASA's Butch Wilmore and SUNY Williams, who blasted off for what was supposed to be a short trip on June 5th, were now stuck in orbit. This after the pair seemingly failed to return home, nearly two months on from when they first took off. Eager to establish what was going on, Naga opened up the probe, asking Ken, when people hear the story, are these astronauts in distress? Is there a real concern about what is going on because they've been up there much much longer than expected? Pointing out the inaccuracy with regards to her question, the expert shot back, slapping Naga down. He responded, that's been much much exaggerated. Shooting down the host's claims, Ken told her. The astronauts are happy as clams to be up there. Astronauts are meant to be in space, that's what they want to do and they are not in any imminent danger, no. He added, yes there are issues with the Boeing Starliner with helium leaks and with the thrusters, but they've done testing of those systems in orbit to confirm that they work and that the astronauts can actually come home at any time. The doctor in science explained that further testing had been carried out and declared, they're not stranded. They're not stuck in space, they're happy to be where they are, they are contributing to science and the maintenance of the International Space Station so they are doing exactly what should have been done. Ken did outline that the space trip hadn't been faultless and that there had been issues along the way. But from his professional viewpoint, everything was now in order and the biggest faux pas was actually due to NASA not providing an open-ended window for the spacecraft's return. The initial target for the mission was just one week which the space expert told Naga and Charlie had been NASA's biggest PR problem after they'd continued to delay the return every four days in the beginning, until Ken stepped in to advise them otherwise.